final day in 1936 brought the usual host of enthusiasts into London by road, rail and air. They've all come up to see the cup final. But there's been so much in the newspapers about the film war that half of them don't know if they're going to see a football match or a fight. When they see our fleet of aeroplanes and autogyros, they'll think it's the air pattern. But for the time being, all is forgotten while the fans see London. Arsenal arrived from Brighton and went to Wembley by coach. Sheffield left their hotel near London. Now at Wembley, as the time draws near for the start, the crowds stream along the familiar streets. They're all going into Wembley Stadium. That's where they're different from us. We are not. With dewy eyes, we watch the chosen few going in to see the Great Cup final. For this year, as you've heard, the FA will not allow the newsreels inside. I don't know what it feels like to be on the FA, but on the newsreels we feel like love locked out. But it's no good trying to get inside. The officials are too. Stop that man, he's got a camera. Oh. Thanks for trying, Sydney. Now the game is about to commence. From our fleet of planes and auto gyros, you can almost hear the band. Not quite. Arsenal have won the toss and decided to kick against the wind. The direction of the wind depends on which way our planes are going. Both goals were in peril in the early stages of the game. Arsenal attacking through Bastin, James and Hume. You can easily pick out James, he's the tall one in shorts. At half time we hadn't lost a plane. Johnson, the Sheffield pivot, got married on the day the team came up to London, but his manager said no, he had to play in the second half like everyone else. Arsenal did most of the attacking in the second half and kept on pressing the Sheffield defence without getting that all-important goal. But in the end, Bastin gave the ball to Drake and Drake scored. Arsenal won, Sheffield nil. If you didn't see it, it's because you're not air-minded. So we'll say hard luck, Sheffield. You played a great game, and it was great football that got you to the final. And well played, Arsenal, with congratulations to George Allison. To Hapgood. Alec James, their captain. Joe Hume. Roberts, centre-half, Bastin, left-winger. Cupping, and the winning goal scorer, Drake. Well played, Arsenal.